Hey, what is your best tip? Before you watch this, what's your best tip to make your fragrance last longer? Please list that down below. Hello perfume addicts, this is Anna Absolute, and welcome to my channel. If you're new, please consider subscribing and clicking that notification bell so you can be notified every time I upload. Guys, today's video is going to be how to make your fragrances last longer. Okay, um, like my friend here, Lost Cherry, a lot of fragrances, oh you smell so good. A lot of fragrances don't last very long. And depending where you are in the world, it may not last at all. Not over two hours. Here in Alaska, we don't have very high humidity, especially in the winter, it's dry AF. And it's cold here, so um, fragrance reacts with heat. Literally, I won't smell my fragrance all day. And then at the gym, when I used to go to the gym, before, you know. Everything got shut down. Um, like I wouldn't even smell my perfume and then I'd be in the sauna at the end of the day and I could smell it in there. So it really just depends on a lot on your environment, but also some fragrances just need a lot of help depending on their strength as well. Anyways, this video is to give you my five tips on how to make your fragrances last longer and or what you can do about them. So the first tip is know where to spray. Concentrate your sprays on your pulse points. That is where your body is the warmest. That's where you can feel your heartbeat. And um, it's, it's, I don't know. You know, honestly, I just heard it a lot. I heard it everywhere. <laughs> That's why I'm telling you. Guys, your pulse points are your neck, your wrists, inside of your elbows, and the back of your knees. Also, I would also spray your boobs like area, if you're a woman, that, well for me is, you know, it's real hot up in there, but yeah, that's number one. Number two, do not rub your fragrance in after you spray it. Don't rub it in. That breaks up the molecules and your fragrance does not last longer, okay? You ruin it. So after you spray, let it air dry. Let it air dry down. Is it just me or in this part of the video, does it look like I am trying to send you like secret hand signals? <laughs> like a secret code to something? Oh my gosh. Embarrassing. And get all settled onto your skin before moving on to the next step. And tip number three, over spray yourself. Overspray. If you want it to last longer, the more you spray, the longer it will last and the stronger it will be, honestly. You might offend some, but if that this is your goal, overspray yourself. Yeah, duh. Team overspray forever. Actually, I'm honestly, I'm not that much of an oversprayer. Yeah, I do what is coming up next. But overspraying does help make your fragrance last longer. 10 sprays, baby, 10. Ten sprays is not even overspray for some people. Some people think that that's normal. Anyways, yeah, next. Spray your clothes and your hair. So yes, fragrance does react to heat, but because it reacts to heat on your body, it, it gets used up faster, if that makes any sense. Fragrances cling into the materials of your clothing and just get locked in there and literally fragrance on clothes can last days. Also, ladies, or men too these days, um, spray your hair. Um, be careful because there's a lot of alcohol in fragrance, but if your hair is like well moisturized and you have product in it, it is pretty safe to um, spray your hair with it. But there are also hair fragrances that you can use too, that you can um, get the regular perfume and the hair fragrance and use them in combination to just keep yourself smelling good all day. <laughs> and I also read a trick online that you can spray your hairbrush and then comb it into your hair be to save yourself from the alcohol, so that is an option, but yeah. Um, spray your hair, spray your clothes, 
spray everything you can spray. That will keep you smelling good all day. Tip like number five. Before you apply your fragrance, put on a really, really bomb moisturizer. One that you know lasts forever. My go-to is Aquaphor. I'm sure all y'all saw this. Vaseline works as well. Something like, um, like a barrier moisturizer that they, these last forever. Put these on your pulse points or just wherever you're spraying your fragrance, put that on beforehand. This will hold the fragrance above your skin a little longer. Why am I smelling this? This is not a perfume. You could use a scented moisturizer or even like the same scent as perfume that you're wearing. Like layering your products will definitely help out. But I don't wear, um, I don't wear any lotions or any, I don't really use any other body products that have fragrance in it. So I like to use Aquaphor. Aquaphor, um, lasts really long and aquaphor like fills in all those cracks on your skin and kind of gives like a like a smooth surface and the fragrance will sit on that surface and heat up with your skin without like getting completely um absorbed into your skin and which will in turn help your fragrance last longer so Hopefully that made sense. I think it did. But yeah, this is um, one, a really, really good trick. And my favorite is Aquaphor, but you can use like Vaseline and other, you know, similar products like that if you're not using um, a fragranced lotion. And my last tip is when you just give up, your, the fragrance doesn't last long, it never will. It doesn't matter how much lotion you put on. It doesn't matter, you sprayed it in your hair, you sprayed it on your clothes, you sprayed it on your socks, you sprayed it in your shoes, you sprayed your car, and literally still an hour later it's gone. You gotta carry it with you in your bag. Um, the past two weeks I've been carrying my fragrance. I always carry two fragrances with me, even if they do last long, I always have at least two fragrances in my bag. And I just recently, um, was contacted by Teddy Blake and they sent me this beautiful 12 inch Kate Stampato bag. Um, it is beautiful. It is real Italian leather made in Italy. Guys, I can fit tons of stuff in here. Like for a video, if you guys, I'll, I'll put it on the screen. I made a little short video for Instagram, a reel. <laughs> I made a reel and all of these fragrances literally fit in this bag at once. Um, I can fit a whole bunch of stuff in here, guys. Teddy Blake is pretty affordable for what you're getting. They are quality bags. Like I said, real leather as well. If you're a fan of real leather, you I think you'd love these. Um, it's beautiful. I've been carrying it around with me everywhere. I'm gonna put all their information below. I'll also put my, my coupon code on the screen and that will also be listed below too. I don't make anything off of it at all. I actually don't make anything for talking about this bag. I honestly have tried it out for the, this past two weeks and it's the only bag I use right now. I do have a, I have a Tory Burch bag and then really I just use a lot of Zara bags. But this is like perfect. It stands nicely. Um, the stitching is really like quality stitching as well. Um, guys, I really like it. Check out their website. Everything will be listed down below. And yeah, I think you guys would really like these. Also, they're having like a big um, Black Friday sale. So check them out on Black Friday. They actually do a lot of really good discounts. Um, my discount code you can only use if you miss a sale. So, I mean, I don't make any money off it. So don't, you know, I don't, it's okay not to use my code guys. <laughs> if you guys want a bag, but let me know if you guys do get a bag, I'd love to know. Or if you have one from them. Yeah guys, so um, when you give up, carry it around with you. You could also put, um, you can also decant your fragrance into like a little mini bottle. I got these off Amazon in like a pack of a lot. Um, I don't use them as much as I thought I was going to use them because like I said, I just carry the full perfume in my bag. But um, you could spray these and carry them. That's a little, it's a lot smaller. But um, guys, yeah. If you guys have any great tips, please list them down below. I wish you guys couldn't see my hands. I'm using my hands a lot. I don't know why. Just wanted to tell everybody on this day of thanks that I am truly thankful and grateful for you. And yeah, we've got to 5K. I'm so happy 
and literally blessed. I hope you guys are stuffing your faces thoroughly today.